Today we are at Bikini Creek, which is located in St. Clair County, and the Conservation Photographers of Alabama have partnered with two other nonprofits. One being the Friends of Bikini Creek, which is a, a local grassroots organization dedicated to conserving the area along Bikini Creek, and the other nonprofit is the Freshwater Land Trust, um, which specializes in land conservation, um, especially land that will promote conservation and promotion of fresh water. My name is Emily Horton and I'm with the Conservation Photographers of Alabama. We're a group of photographers who are dedicated to conserving the biological and cultural diversity of Alabama using photography and other media as a tool. And we really promote partnering with nonprofits, the public, governmental organizations, as broad a spectrum as possible to unite in our conservation efforts and be more effective. Today we are here to do a bio blitz. So basically um, a bio blitz is typically a 24 hour survey of the biological diversity of a given area. And in this case, the area is a tract located along Big Canoe Creek that has been nominated for the Forever Wild Program, which is a land conservation program. The tract has been nominated because we hope that it will eventually be purchased um, and put into permanent protection and owned by the State Lands Division. And a bio blitz basically brings together, as Carl Peters from the Freshwater Land Trust uh, describes it as an ecological boot camp where you bring together a, a wonderful team of scientists and naturalists who have different specialties. Some people might study fish, others bats, um, mammals, herpetologists, amphibians, reptiles, um, and they go in and take a within a short amount of time, go in, survey and document as many different species within their relative specialization as possible. Um, so today we were out with uh, Mike Howell, um, who is an, an, a biologist, and he was seining and we were taking the fish and photographing it and they were, the scientists were identifying the fish while the photographers would photograph some of the more important, um, more beautiful species to complement the data, the scientific data that the scientists are collecting for this bio blitz. This is the second bio blitz that the Freshwater Land Trust, the nonprofit we're partnering with, and this is the second bio blitz that they've done. But this is the first time they've actually had a group of photographers and media specialists, videographers, um, a writer, via the Conservation Tigers Alabama to actually partner with them. Um, and what we hope to accomplish with that and to enhance the conservation efforts and the scientific data that they're already collecting that they were going to do anyways is really to elevate by combining our forces together to elevate our conservation efforts to a whole nother level. So now when they they submit a follow-up report to the Forever Wilds program instead of just having data about um, 30 species of this animal or 80 species of this plant we really want to um, inspire the people who are looking at this data and let them connect with it by providing high quality images and even video um, from our group, our team of conservation photographers and other media specialists. And that's basically why we're here. Ultimately, um, our purpose is conservation and, and seeking to partner with as many other conservation conservationist and environmentally focused groups as possible to accomplish more together in the state of Alabama to conserve our biological and even cultural diversity that's, that's really unique to this region of the U.S. and the world.